Hello everyone, Ted the Old Star Wars Nerd here. Hope you're doing well. And I want to thank you for joining me today as we watch another Star Wars fan film. Well, actually, this isn't a fan film. This is um, an interview. This is a, a a website called Star Wars 100 Interviews. And I've watched one of their interviews before, and it was with um, um, not Tamora Morrison. It was the kid who played Boba Fett. I can't remember his name right now, but uh, I watched that one. And they've got more like that on their site, too. And they just came out with this one a few days ago. This is called Clive Revel, the Early Emperor, Star Wars 100 review Interviews. So Clive Revel, if you don't know, he was the guy that voiced the uh, Emperor originally in The Empire Strikes Back. Before, you know, the special editions, back when they used um, a different face for the Emperor. The face was made up of, it was like half monkey, half... Uh, some other person, I believe, I think it was the, yeah, it was the lady. I can't remember her name. Uh, it might be in this video, I guess we're going to watch. So yeah, if you haven't seen that version of it, I've got another video I'm going to do about um, Clive Revel and the first emperor here soon, but I thought this would be a good interview to show and just get out there and let more people see it. So yeah, here we go. Clive Revel, the early emperor. And I got very close to the microphone, and I will to the microphone in this. There is a great disturbance in the Force. Sci-Fi Central with Daryl J. James. Hi, DJ here, and welcome to the channel with over a hundred Star Wars performers who were all in the movies. When we hit our 1,000 subscriber goal, we'll release a couple of huge interviews we're currently editing. So please help out your fellow Force fans to find the channel. So if you would, please share our... And right now they've only got 300 and some right odds, so yeah, they need to get more, more, about the first version more subscribers to them. At Celebration, I found another star from The Empire Strikes Back. Hello, sir, what's your name? Clive Revill. Now, how will the fans know you best? I have no idea. I've been away from New Zealand for 60 <laughs> years. Well, you are New Zealand born, which is fantastic for our fans down under. No question. Wrong at High College. Left at the. Mm. Uh, I've never age seen of that about, before. I think about 48, something like that. Fantastic. Mm. And your career really took off big time there. And I also believe you knew the director, Irvin Kirshner, before The Empire Strikes Back. Irvin and I were great friends, and I'd done a couple of pictures for him. And well, the story was that he called me up and he said, look, can you come down to a recording studio down on um, Wilshire Boulevard in Los Angeles? There's something we can't, we're looking for something and we don't know what it is. And I said, well, I'll go down. And uh, he said, there it is. And he gave it to me on paper, which was a bit <laughs> baffling. And I said, well, what are the, what's the parameters? You know, what's the style of it? He said, you'll have to find that yourself. And I said, well, what is it about? He said, well, it's about someone or something who is possibly in charge of the entire universe. And I got very close to the microphone, and I will to the microphone in this. There is a great disturbance in the Force. Clive was the original Look at voice, that. and rather interestingly, the image of the character was a mixture of Marjorie Eaton or Elaine Baker under the hood, combined with superimposed eyes from a chimp. That's right, yellow looking chimp eyes were used as the eyes of the Sith. <laughs> Let's get back to Clive, yeah? Yes. And of course, Disney are widening the Star Wars universe. Are you still acting, sir? Are you available for more Star Wars? No, I've hung up my wigs a long time ago. <laughs> no, I'm. I'm... I'm not called on that. I don't have that That's agent cool. anymore. That's no. No, I do voice work and listen to the grass grow. <laughs> listen to the grass grow. That's always good fun, isn't it? Well, I am 84 now and um, wow. I'm soon to be 85. <laughs> uh, if you want to. I've been relaxed a long time. I don't really, I don't really worry me anymore. Actually, no time for relaxation. You've got a big queue of people to sign for. Yes, it's an incredible. Um, That's too cool. Business, this, and the the enthusiasm of people, and I really mean in, in, in genuine enthusiasm, which means that a part of their inner being is with Star Wars, and it's one of the most extraordinary concepts ever invented. 
Yes. Mm -hmm. I think we're up to 110 different character interviews right here on the channel. So please like, subscribe, share our link and feel free to comment and look around the channel. Stand by for more interview links at the end. Hope you enjoy the channel. Catch you soon. So thank you. Thank you. That was pretty damn cool. Love hearing about the original Emperor and about the original Star Wars. That's, um, it kind of seems weird to me when I watch Star Wars with other people because I only watch Harmony's Despecialized Edition and people are like, well, where's this? Well, what's that? And I'm like, I completely forgot that that's a whole generation, probably two generations now have grown up with the special editions of Star Wars as their Star Wars. So they're used to seeing all these bits and pieces that have been added um, that I just, I don't recognize when I see it. So anyway, that's, that was a very cool interview. I love that. Love hearing from Clive Revel. I've never seen an interview with him before, but yeah, I didn't know if they, they used the chimp. I didn't know it was chimp eyes. I thought it was part of the chimp face, but yeah, chimp eyes. And then an amalgamation between a headpiece and this other lady's face. And very cool. I suggest you go watch that uh, clip. If you can find a clip of the old original, emperor the scene with vader so yeah that was very cool hope you enjoyed that i really enjoyed that i'm gonna go through their channel find some more interviews to watch because i love seeing that old stuff like that so i hope you do too and yeah so leave a comment below click the like button click the subscribe button click that bell for notifications and uh you know leave me more suggestions on stuff you'd like to see me watch all right Again, I am Ted the Old Star Wars Nerd. Thanks for watching with me. I really appreciate it. You take care until next time. Thanks.